great to be back in the UK. Off to one of the most spectacular shows I've done in my career. Today is show day, Stonehenge. The way the show came about was Alan, my partner, works very closely with English heritage. Alan, knowing that I'd done Mount Everest, the Great Wall of China, and Ashwire, which is a thousand year old rainforest in a small town three, four hours before Antarctica. He felt that I would be the perfect person to get involved. So I'm very excited. I've been working on the music. This is the run through at, as you can see, Stonehenge. And what I'm doing is the selection of music that I've been working on for the last five months in preparation for this show. I'm now timing it to the sunset so I can hopefully nail it in one. I'm ready, I'm just waiting to, uh, to get going. We're gonna head over to the site now. Yeah, 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 no, it doesn't get perfect. any better than that. Um, I can feel it already. Yes, no, there is definitely <laughs> a vibe in here. No, there is. <laughs> that is happening, that is happening. And yeah. the small stones uh, have um, acoustic properties, they ring if you bang them together, but please don't bang these ones together. <laughs> no, but yeah. for us to get to be allowed to be right in the middle is not something that really no, the general public can so. So the show itself will not be a traditional DJ set. And what I mean by that is I won't be playing all electronic music. Of course I'm not in a nightclub. I'll be doing a collective set of music that has inspired me over many years. 